my God. They found me. I don't know how, but they found me. Run for it, Marty! Hey YouTube, Fat Pastor here. Today, we got something new. The Mobe Light HD Zero 1S 75mm Whoop. Let's get right into it. I don't normally do unboxings, but I had a request to do an unboxing on this one. So, what comes in the box is HD Zero Divermath stickers. Express LRS Happy Model. It's got extra props. It's got the little dongle to upgrade. It's got a cover for the back of the camera, a little prop remover, and a screwdriver. Comes with an extra canopy. Let's look at the, at the quad. Let's get this box out of our way. What we've got is we've got the standard Whoop Light HD Zero VTX with the Nano camera on it standard dipole I may switch this one out for the true RC SMO this has the smaller port so you will need this little dongle to upgrade your firmware so don't lose this let's get a weight on this Twenty nine point two grams. That's what I'm showing. This is all stock. We're going to do a few flights on it and see how she performs. This is the Express LRS version. It's got the little Express LRS antenna on it. It is not. It is not the one with the ceramic antenna. It's running the Happy Model EX ten o two twenty thousand kV motors. It's running a 40 millimeter 1610 by blade gym fan prop. It's running the Happy Model Super B F4 Light ELRS flight controller. I've noticed mine right out of the package. This plastic piece right here is covering part of the USB. This is not good. I'm going to need to trim this out. If you're not careful, you can break off your USB connector comes with the larger battery tray for running three, four to 600 milliamp batteries. It's running the HD Zero Nano Light camera. Let's cut to some flight footage of the stock setup and then I'll come back and let you know of any alterations, any changes I make. I'm fairly positive I'm gonna be removing this PH 2.0 and putting it on a BT 2.0 connector. But let's see how she flies out of the box.
you to see some flight footage. Wow, I think these 1002 20,000 kV motors really suit this frame and this size. I was pleasantly surprised at how well it flew. I don't know that this would be my choice for an indoor whoop, but outdoors, yes, this is a nice model, a nice improvement. Long flight times, very cruisable, has the power when it needs it. Just an all-around fun whoop. Pick you up one of them. And a special shout out to Tom at Fine RC for sending this out to me. Go by there. Tom is kind of a smaller shop, but he's getting this stuff in pretty quick. Works really close with Carl at HD Zero. Guys, give him some business. Give him some love. He stands behind the products. If you want to go fly in a park or something and you don't want to be disturbing people, this is a perfect quad in my opinion. This PH 2.0 connector, it, it really bottlenecks your battery performance. So I'm going to remove it and put the BT 2.0 on it. And I'll probably try it on a set of Jim Fan 40 millimeter tri-blade props and see what that's like. But go out and pick you up one of these. This quad will be included in my HD Zero Whoop Roundup. So stay tuned for that. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. And as always, keep flying and rise up and meet me in the air. God bless.